There's the gold gold. He's coming in. He's right there. And he's about 100 right there. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. This is the Hunter D33 and today we're going to be going after every animal in Africa with the 4570 Lever Action Coachmate. And I think we're going to start with the scrub here. Now this spot's a very particular location that I found while trying to find Cape Buffalo. This spot right here is where we're going to go and you wouldn't believe it but there's actually a ton of scrub hair here. Alright so this spot that we're at is pretty good and the way I found this spot was by looking for Cape Buffalo. I saw a bunch of scrub here here and we have one right there. And we have our first scrub hair down. Look at them all taking off over here. They're absolutely everywhere. Alright, so I'll show you where we're at. If you want to find some scrub here and just absolutely a ton of them, come down here right to this road and basically start right here. Go all the way down to this point. Alright, well, let's pick her up. We actually made an intestine and stomach shot. She scores 4.7, total score of 707. So it looks like she might have been a decent sized one for a female. It seems like it's a pretty good sized one. Oh, there's one right there. I just caught eyes on one. It is a female and I think, oh, we got her. I thought we might have shot a little bit high, but there's one right there. Come on, step out. I think we made a headshot. Yep, got it. All right, so we have two down. Let's go pick them up. This was a female. She scored 3.1, total score of 519. And we made a double lung shot, actually. And if you saw, we took the scope off on that one because they were so close. It really does help to take the scope off. Let's go over here now and go pick up this one. And it might be a little bit more difficult than I thought to try and find one of these nice males. Because so far, it looks like all we have here are females. But we'll keep trying. Yeah, this was a female. She scores 3.5, total score of 569. Made an intestine and stomach shot on her. We have more tracks here, but I don't see any more signs of scrub here anywhere. Oh. Spoke too soon and we just dropped one. All right, here it is. Let's pick it up. I don't even know what it is, so let's pick it up. We finally got ourselves a nice male. This one scores 3.4, total score of 555, and we made a double lung shot. And I think that's going to do for the scrub here. So now we're going to go see if we can find some lesser kudu or maybe even some springbok. Well, I think you guys can kind of see what's next. We have a gold-colored, what should be a gold wildebeest out here, along with a whole herd of wildebeest. They're absolutely everywhere. There probably could be maybe even a diamond out here. We should probably check actually before we go after this gold one. Even though the gold one is probably the one we're going to go for. Oh, that's a big guy right there. That's uh, definitely 900 plus. Oh, there's the gold. There's the gold gold. We found the gold gold. He's right out. What is that? That's a three easy. There's the gold gold. He's coming in. He's right there. That's our primary focus right now. We're going to go for this gold gold. And as soon as he comes in... We're going to see if we can't take a couple more of these out on the run after that. But for now, we're going to go for this gold gold. And he's about 100 right there. We went for a heart shot, and I don't know what we hit. Yeah, I don't know if we got a single lung on that or what, but it's not looking too good, I'll tell you that. All right, so we smoked this first gold one. I thought we were going to hit heart. If anything, we would have hit a uh, shoulder blade and maybe missed it, but according to this, we should have ourselves a nice gold, gold wildebeest down, depending on how good we actually did hit it, and depending on if we can find where it went. I watched it run this way. Yep, here we go. Some more good blood, 25%. Let's slow down a little bit more so we don't lose. Oh, here's some more blood right here. And there he is down, right there. We have ourselves a gold, gold wildebeest. Well, I don't know if it's going to be a gold gold, but it's definitely a gold, if you know what I mean. Here he is down right here, and we took him out with the 4570. Very cool. Can't see him very good, though, so we'll pick him up. He scores silver, 31.2. We made a right lung shot at 111 yards out, and did we miss the heart? And how much did we miss it? It looks like we missed it 
a little bit too much to the left side of it we hit but still awesome shot and we got ourselves a gold silver wildebeest and we just got eyes on the rest of the herd of wildebeest over here but we might be able to get lucky enough to find our four easy that we hit not very good i'll tell you that so it looks like the spring mock is up next we have a female out here and she is about 140 yards out i don't see any males around but there might be some Either way, we're gonna go for a shot at about 140 with the 4570 and see what we can do hold a little bit high and just absolutely piled her up and here she is she's down right here let's pick her up we made a double lung shot and holy we almost missed her look how much it dropped we were holding it two inches above her spine and it looks like we hit basically an inch above the bottom of the lung so wow at 100 oh she was 166 yeah i guess 40 yards difference makes a pretty big difference we got a zero percent integrity on that but she scores 69 and total score of 433 a pretty decent sized female all right guys so i actually went back over to find the track from that wildebeest that we took a shot at that number four easy he was a really big wildebeest um i couldn't find the track naturally so i had to turn the tracks on really quick but luckily we did because we have a non-vital hit here so that means we have a big wildebeest that should be down and that will also keep our harvest value at 100 percent so i'm very excited that we hit that wildebeest so good we actually let him i thought was too much but apparently we let him just right so we're going to track him down and see if we can't find this wildebeest so we just got a call from another wildebeest here as we're trying to find that first one but i don't know what this one actually is it might be him no it is a three easy it's definitely a big one but it is resting and it's nervous okay so he just bedded down and he's gonna stay down all right here he is let's pick him up he actually was a gold a big gold 34.6 total score of 882 and it made a lung and spine shot at 137 yards out this 4570 really did a nice job on this big wildebeest all right so after a while i actually turned off the tracks again because i couldn't find any more tracks anywhere around and what happened is we literally just ran right into our wildebeest that we hit the four easy he's down right here so luckily i don't even know how we saw him because look how thick this grass is here there's no way we would have seen him look there's no tracks anywhere near this wildebeest here except for maybe that that was one right there but you couldn't even see it look at how far buried in the grass this wildebeest is and luckily we managed to run right past him and did see where he's at so i kind of want to pat this grass down here and see if we can see him a little bit better i don't think we really can but yeah you know what that helped a little bit but not much let's pick him up he scores 35.5 and we made a running 171 yard intestine shot on him with the 4570 so pretty nice shot on this big wildebeest he scores total score of 735 on him because we didn't quite hit him good enough to be a perfect 100 percent drop shot but we still hit him pretty solid and he went down A running 171 yard shot with the 4570 isn't the easiest thing to do because you have to get the lead down just right otherwise you'll end up getting a flesh hit so the fact that we got a vital hit on him i'm very happy with that so we just got a call from a warthog right here it's a male and he's putting out some warning calls right now so we got to get ready he is not happy i can't see him yet though and we have really good wind i guess we'll just wait until he starts walking this way we'll pop up and be able to take a shot Let's pop up. I see him. Dropped him. I don't even know if that was the big one or not. Yeah, I could see he had nice tusks on him, so he's definitely a decent male. We took the shot, and we got a nice goal. Total score of 801. He scores 43, and he was a gray. Looks like we made a stomach, liver, and lung shot. So we actually just picked up the track from the other one, and it looks like it was just a smaller to medium-sized male. So we might have actually gotten the big one. I think we'll head this way and see if we can't spot him again so we just got eyes on some kudu out here and this is actually a pretty nice one it's a three very easy 26 to 35 score and he's about 165 yards out we're gonna zero in for 160 and see if we can take a shot and i think that was a clear miss 
So we just caught up to a whole herd of springbok. They're all over the place. It sure would be a good time to be in that blind right about now. But we're laying here prone and we're trying to find a decent sized male. I think that's going to work right there actually. There was one a little bit bigger. Okay, that's the one we want. And if he calms down and doesn't stop right behind the blind. Uh oh, they're coming in fast, really fast. We went for a shot and definitely hit him. And we got that one hit as well. All right, so it's going to be difficult to try and find some of these though, but that one should go down right there. In fact, that one just went down. So we'll be able to find that one. And I think we hit one more. And I'm hoping that the big one went down as well. All right, so as you can see, we definitely hit one here. And one. Oh, well, I guess they're not going to be too hard to find. There's one right here. And there's one right there. So let's pick this one up. This is actually a decent sized male here. He scores 86. We made a running. Right lung shot at 99 yards out. Really cool looking male right there. And then this is the female that we got on the run the second time. Let's pick this one up. This was a female. She scores 70. Hit her on the run of the intestine at 74 yards out. And let's go over here and go see if we can find the biggest of the males. Which I hope he didn't go too far. We might have actually hit him in the neck. In which case he might have ran quite a ways. I'm hoping that it dropped a little bit at that distance, but it might not have. Oh, that would be a flush hit. So I've been looking around this whole time trying to find that springbok, and I can't see him anywhere here. So I don't know where he went, but at least we did get a male. So I think we're just going to leave this one and continue on to maybe find some kudu. Well, then, I guess never mind about what I just said, because if you look right, well, right there, you can see we found our springbok. Yeah, he's down. I don't know how we found him. Again, we just were running around and got lucky and ran right into him and found him somehow. So I really want to see where we actually hit. We actually hit him in the skull. Okay, so we were a little bit too high on that. We should have stayed zeroed in for 109. Instead, we were zeroed in for 160, and I think we hit a little bit high. He scores 88 and a total score of 425. Pretty decent size springbok. All right, so we just came over to see what happened with that kudu, and I found him laying down. In fact, there's another kudu there. And a kudu there. It looks like a couple of female. And here we have a jackal. We have a couple of jackals coming in. It's exactly what we want right now. But if you look right there, you can see our kudu is down. This one's out here at about 100 yards out. I think that'll work. I would say we hit it. And I would say we might not have hit in that one. And that jackal is down right there. Let's see if we can reload and possibly get one more of these jackals. It's a long ways out there, but I think we could possibly make it happen. Once he slows down. We got a hit. Oh, dropped him. Perfect shot. Yeah, I'm glad we hit him pretty good because it would be tough to track these guys down. But let's go over here now and go see if we can pick up this kudu and maybe find this Cape Buffalo. All right, so here's our kudu down. Let's pick him up. He scores 28.4 and it looks like... Wow. It looks like we had a good shot, but we didn't get any penetration from that angle. I guess we might have hit the hip bone on that and it probably slowed it down a little bit, but it was going right for the top of the lung spine. Anyways, he scores 28.4, decent sized kudu, and we got him. And here's the jackals, let's pick him up. This was a female at 85 yards out and looks like we hit a little bit high on that, but we still got her. And this one was an awesome 158 yard, looks like a right lung shot. Awesome shot on her, she scores 16.0. All right, so last we need the Cape Buffalo, and we just approach a whole herd of them right over this ridge. We're going to walk over to the top and see if we can't see them down on the other end. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. He's right there. He's right there. Oh, come on. Don't. Come on. Stop. Stop. The first shot wasn't very good, but the second one definitely was, and so was the third one. We got to watch him, because if he doesn't go down, we're not going to find him. And here he is down right here. Look at that. So he actually might have a chance at being a pretty good sized gold cape buffalo. Because I believe you can hit him up to four times with the 4570 and still get full integrity. 
and this one didn't go too far really cool let's actually take a picture of him because he's in a pretty cool position as well really cool all right yeah let's go with that and let's pick him up and he was a silver it looks like we didn't quite hit him good enough that first shot a little bit too low we hit him there second shot we did get a double long shot at 33 yards out and then the third shot we didn't get any penetration which was going pretty much right for the heart but we did get him he scores 133 total score of 765 a really nice cape buffalo and i think that's gonna be a pretty good way to end this video so i hope you guys enjoyed it if you liked it please give it a thumbs up thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time go with that and let's pick him up oh my god a 210 scoring diamond white tail buck